here in the assistance ice cream. That's probably plenty. But this is the very first opening. So this is our very first customer for the assistance ice cream igloo. Hey everyone and welcome to my ice cream igloo. The assistance ice cream igloo. This is where you can make fun ice cream stuff, right? Right. And I have my setup all right here. So this is the ice cream igloo, right? Ice cream igloo. But first, before we can make our ice cream, we have to make containers for the ice cream. So you're going to make waffle cones, right? Right. Waffle cone bowls. And then we're going to make rolled ice cream right here. Right, so right. the first thing you need to do is go ahead and make the waffle cones, right? Right. So this has already been preheating, so we got oh uh, wait, never mind. Gotta open it up. Open it up, just like that. Make sure it's been preheated before you have done anything. Then, we need to get something to butter it with. Yeah, so lightly butter the top and bottom. Not a whole lot of butter, right? Yeah. Just maybe just a little bit. She's gonna put a little butter on the bottom. Put a little on the top. Right, that'll make it golden brown, right? Right, it will make it look a lot better in presentation. Just like that, one more. All right, and then you put a half of cup of our special waffle cone mix in each one. Right, we just bought a, a waffle cone mix that we found on Amazon, right? Yeah. It's called Krusty Waffle Cones. Right here. Okay, so we want one fourth, right? Yeah, in, in, in each one. So that means we need to do half of a half cup. Alright, so okay. put it in. Is that about good? Yep, so pour it in. Just like that, and now once we poured it in, we have to work fast to get the other one in. Yep, put the other one in. We don't have to work too fast. Good, good. Now you close it up, and we're going to have to leave it in our waffle cone maker for six minutes, right? Six minutes, so we'll come back to you then. And then what we're going to do is we're going to make our waffle cones, and then we're going to put it on, use our roll ice cream. Right. So the oh. next step will be the assistant makes your ice cream, right? Right. All right. So we'll see you in six minutes. Oh, that'll just seem like a second for you. Woo! Whee! All right, we're back. All right, assistant, so we got to gently open up our uh, waffle cone maker. With this? Uh, or you can just use your hand. Oh, okay. All right, so one of them looks like it's a little small and the other one looks good. So let's pull it off. Just like that. Put it on our thing. And she's gonna put it on our tray. Now she's pulling the next one off. She puts it on the tray. So these are our two waffle cones that we've made, right? Right. I'm going to close this. Yeah, we need to close that so we don't get burned. Here we go. And now we're ready for to make our ice cream. Ice cream! Alright, so, so we're going to have our solution. We're going to turn it on and we're ready to go. Okay, assistant. So while we are waiting for that to cool, what are you going to do? Alright. So we have our condensed milk right here. So That's actually can... the heavy whipped milk. You've got to add the condensed milk. This is the condensed milk. That's right. <laughs> I mixed it up. So we got to put it in there. Just like that. Make sure to get as much of it as you can. Yeah, so it's half a pint of heavy whipped milk. I think this is 14 ounces. And then 14 ounces of sweetened condensed milk, right? Yeah. That's the solution that we use. Woo! And then she's gonna mix it up, and then we're gonna use that as our ice cream batter, right? Ice cream! You think it's gonna look like this right here? Uh, ours is gonna be more like rolls, not like a. Sundae. Oh, that's right. All right, so we're gonna put that Almost out. Almost done. Just gotta get the rest of it out of there. Cause we still have a little bit left, see? Yep, get it, you can get it out. Okay, now we stir. But you gotta make sure you stir. You don't stir all oh, wow, look at this. Look at that. It looks kind of like taffy. It does, doesn't it? So well, you gotta make sure it's really well mixed, right? Or like the inside of a cow tail. Or the outside of a cow tail. Oh, the candy. Oh, the candy, okay. I think you meant a real cow. <laughs> we'll mix it really well. And then we're gonna start putting it on the roller, right? <laughs> right. Alright, so it's cool enough for us to put the mix on it, and we are going to be making Oreo. You're going to make Oreo roll ice cream, right? 
right here. What are we in? Ice cream igloo. And the ice cream igloo, right? All right. So you gotta, you, you can reuse that same half cup. Just make sure if it's a half cup when you put it on there, okay. or it'll be too much so or too little. We made it too with too much before, and it didn't work well, did it? No, it, it wouldn't freeze over because. Uh, it wasn't cold enough. You have to have a the surface. Okay, if it's too thick, it won't work real well. Yeah. All right, so now you're going to add your ingredients, right? We're going to use two Oreos, so a top and a bottom. Top and a bottom. What? And sometimes... Oh, yeah, I forgot to crumble it up in my hand. Oh, yeah, you want to crumble it up in your hand. So we'll do one of them. And then we've used the Hershey's chocolate before right on top, but that but, seems to keep it from rolling real well. So yet. we're going to try it with see if it does any better, yep. or if it's different. So now, I'll chop up the ingredients. Chop, chop, chop. So when we're done, we're going to add a little chocolate and garnish it up, right? Presentation is key. Well, and it'll make it taste pretty chocolatey too, right? Right. And you want to press down on, on it. That way it can make it as thin as possible. Yep. So you want to thin it out, kind of like you're smearing a paste, right? Right. I need to put this other one down. Okay, you kind of only need one. And then when you roll it, you actually want to have a clean spatula, right? Right. We have paper towels and the ice cream igloo to clean it off. Because in the ice cream igloo, our motto is clean the spatulas. And good ice cream for everybody, right? Yeah. Okay. So see how she's making it nice and thin? Alright, I'm gonna do it this way, but I'm gonna move out of the way. Okay. So what are you doing now, assistant? I'm just spreading it out, and then we'll wait a couple seconds once I'm done, or a couple minutes actually, for it to freeze over. That way it will be in the perfect condition to roll. Now we can let it 
freeze over because it's really thin right now. Let's just clear right, off so the spatula. Right now, you're gonna put your spatula down and you're gonna do your ice cream dance. So when you're done with your ice cream dance, it's gonna be ready to roll, right? Bitch, roll! Roll in! Roll 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 this is the waffle cones that we made. It right? gets harder over time, so that's why we're letting it just sit. So that one's good. That one didn't come out quite as well. So this one can just be a snack on, because yeah, they taste like waffles. They're pretty good though, aren't they? All right, so. Well, I mean, waffles are good. So if you like waffles, waffle cones, you'll like. Yep. Especially homemade ones, because it tastes like waffles. All right, so why don't you see if you can cut it? Screen dance, okay. Cut it. I would use the clean, I would use a not. Oh, the bubble. dirty, yeah. Right, okay. So we have one to, to kind of. So she's making it one spatula thick. Ooh, we can make a lot. Okay, there we go. Alright, now let's see if you can roll it. Okay. What? Oh, it's helping along the way. Oh, it might not be ready yet. Oh, okay. Maybe keep going on that one, though. Okay. Because it's a little, um... It's a little milky, right? Yeah. But this one looks pretty good. It, I mean, it's rolling. All right. So, now that we have that one, we can use the tongs All to put... You, put the, you hold up the waffle cone. So there's our first one, right? This one can get a little bit better presentation on it. Yeah, it kind of... a little bit. It kind of droops down as it's in there. But there's the first one. Now we can do the smaller one. Look, that one rolled pretty good. Pretty good. Sure did. Alright, so <laughs> I got it. I it right there. Okay, now I think we might be ready. We're ready for the next one. Okay. It kind of is an arm workout if it's really, like, I don't think I got it thin enough. So it's, it will be a little bit harder. Yeah, we probably should have made it a little thinner, right? Right. Oh, it's oh, kind of oh. hard to tell them. Oh, nice. All right, ready? You roll it at the eye. <gasps> this one is really good, okay? There we go. We did it. Okay, I got the bowl. Oh! There's a bowl. This looks so good. Alright, so now we got two rolls in there. One more! Well, like two, three, two and a half. We'll just do this last one though, right? Yeah. And then we're going to put the sauce on it and show the people the final product and the assistant ice cream igloo. Right! So I'm going to help her roll it since it is a little too thick. <laughs> it's really, really tough. Yeah, I think it's got it's a little too thick this time. Here we go. Let me give you a little help here. Okay. In fact, I'm gonna come from this side. <gasps> Double roll. Yes. There we go. Okay. Uh. Double roll. It's a double roll, right? Okay. There right, we now go. Now hold that up, or I'll hold it, and then you can put some chocolate sauce on it. Yes. So it doesn't look perfect right now, but we made it a little too thick here in the assistant's ice cream. That's probably plenty. But this is the very first opening. So this is our very first customer for the assistant's ice cream igloo. What do you think about that, assistant? Yeah, so the first customer will get this beautiful masterpiece. So turn it around, show everybody what it looks Ooh. like. Turn it slower. It looks like an ice cream dream. Turning, turning. And so you guys saw us make that all from scratch. So make sure you subscribe to the Assistance Corner and, and the, the Engineering Family, right? Yeah. And follow us on TikTok. And thank you for watching. And Instagram. And yeah, Instagram. and all of our social media platforms. But it's real important that you subscribe to the Engineering Family because only 5% of you have subscribed. Right. And next time in the Assistance Ice Cream Igloo, we're going to make soft serve ice cream too, right? Right. Thank you guys so much for watching. Bye.
Bye.